versus Sutan had a little bit of an opportunity to talk to the Buzz all the way on the other side of the room. And the Buzz is quite confident that Sutan is going to be able to dismantle Light. Really? So it's going to be quite fun to see what's going to transpire here. These guys are going to go into it now. Keep in mind that when they played in the last time, it was, I believe, a Game 5 situation where Light had barely lost, and Light was really confident that he'd be able to win. So he might be coming back into this thing and, oh, you know what, I'm going to destroy him. And this is what it's looking like so far. However, it's Olimar we're talking about. All right, and full jab attack coming out from Light. And Light keeps going for these, like, random F-smashes at the ledge. Usually tries to do it whenever they try to get up off the ledge, but now he just did a run-up F-smash. Not going to KO and Light now at 150%. And Fox being one of the lightest characters in the game. Yeah, man. And again, if you uh, miss what we said before, we were talking about the fact that I was talking to the Buzz earlier, and he did mention Ow. that he feels Ow. good job right there to Rage, helping Ow. out too. He, I, it's so far away. <laughs> the Buzz did feel like he thinks that Shuton will most definitely take this, but we'll see if things will actually go the way the Buzz saw it. Yikes. Actually KO'd, and I think that was Red Pikmin back air. I was able to get that KO. I know it's higher percent, but still, that was really strong. I just thought it was a purple Pikmin. Goodness gracious! Yeah, man. Here comes 63 off so much. Hits. So much. You gotta be careful with your approaches against this character, dude. Yeah, I know I was talking about Fox when he can up smash out of shield, but all of them my goodness, that low percent? Oh, it's over, it's over. It's down over. air? Oh. Yes, great timing. He made sure to get outside of the two frame range and just spike him straight down into the blast. You might just be right, man. We'll see. I mean, right now, as far as like the recovery is concerned, he has a really good. He does a really good job of being able to capitalize on it. But, I mean, there's no hitbox on all of my recovery either. Unless he has a pick and whip and he's able to swing. But let's see what we see here from Light. He's been racking up a lot of good damage. Yep, very good damage right now. And uh -oh. he might have him at percent to get the KO. And maybe like 10 or so percent. Probably gets to do a couple hits. Like, I, okay, there we go. And now he might be able to do the player into up smash. We're just running some up smash. We might have to charge him over the scale. Okay. Charging it. Oh, oh. Here comes the Pikmin again. But yeah, using the platform as a safe zone so that he doesn't have to worry about dealing with a forward smash, a side B, or even a potential up smash. But, light, a little risky there. And, oh no, did not run far, far enough to be able to get that up smash to hit. And it looked like he was late too on the draw, right? Yeah. Okay. The shoot's on. You might just see the backer coming out from Pokemon Pikmin. Wait, what? Oh, wait, wait. That was yeah. so <laughs> That was so quiet. <laughs> like, we both were, we just heard thud. And we're, we looked at the top of the screen, waited for Light to come back. <laughs> And he kind of disappeared. It, it was like Smash 4 all over again. <laughs> I was actually, I think, a down there that was able to get the KO. Yeah, uh, good stuff coming out from Shuton where Light looked like he was dominating in that first stock, but Shuton able to bring it back that hard. Maybe the buzz was right, and this is just a clear win for Shuton. This is the tournament for Japan, and we have the headset coming off from Light. And the thing is, you know, we got the whole people saying Vegas, Vegas. We got, you know, some level of New England players in the background, or, or maybe none. And I feel like the crowd is definitely a favorite of Light, so maybe he's just going to take off the headset and let the crowd cheer him on and make him feel more comfortable. That's more true. Too. A lot of players actually feed off of the energy in the crowd, too. That, that gives them a boost, you know? Oh my gosh, trying to go from each player into down. Three up airs? Three entire up airs able to get to <laughs> and that, and That's not the first time we've seen that before, too, man. Olimar's double game is quite potent, man. How's he timing that down tilt right there? Like, oh, oh, the tech, God. though, but, oh uh, yo, Shuton is, on, he's on one, dude. Oh, best edge guard in Smash Ultimate. I said, get out of oh one. God. Yo, I'm telling you, man. <laughs> yo, let him get back on this yo, stage. Yo, it could be purple, it could let be pink, man. Let him get back on the stage, yo, please. I'm just saying, man. Please. <laughs> I'm on one, man. I mean, Shuton's on one, 100%. Jeez, what a guy. And that's another thing. It's not only Shutan's amazing edge guarding ledge trapping, it's also the fact that Light is playing Fox's character when he's forced to up B, puts him in a terrible situation. Luckily he had those uh, side of the stage so he should be able to text him to live 50% longer. So consistent with all these clips at the edge with the down tilt, making it tough for Light to recover every single time. And Light, a little early there. Okay. Reflecting a little too long, making him be able to get that grab. And it's the same situation again. That was like the same shoots on. So how fast he was sneaking in that side B white Pikmin? Yep. After <laughs> Yo, Shuton. And he's like, yeah. okay, I don't need you anymore. Okay, I have a yeah. secondary? Dude, I mean, did we see him play Wolf before or no? Um, I, I don't know, but he, he might just might need to consider it because it's looking really rough. I mean, he might have a Lucina. A lot of people have a Lucina. You have one too, right? Everybody has a Lucina. Of course! <laughs> Technically, Shutan has taken off four stocks in a row without using one stock to get light against light. If you Actually, five stocks in a row. And this might be six stocks in a row if he's able to get the stock here. 
All right, man. I think we had a prophecy again from the people in the Twitterverse. They said this could be Zachary's time to shine. Uh oh. We might finally see it. A, an oh actual. My God. I don't want to. I don't want to will it, He's but gonna do it. He's gonna do it's it. a three stock, and not quite yet. Another opportunity. Light still trying his best to bring it wow. back. Gets intercepted. A three stock. One hundred and twenty-eight percent. Headset off of his head. He needs to figure it out. Dig deep and understand what needs to be done in this scenario. His edge guarding is phenomenal. Keep in mind, Light was able to take off the first stock in the first game, and then shoots on to the next three, and then just three stock Light. So he took off six stocks without losing one. That's wild. That's wild. It, I'd be, I'd actually be shocked to see if Light wins this game. And he decided. I, heard, I saw him do the thing where it looks like you're going back to the same stage. So I think he's going back to Kalos. Let's see if he'll be able to win it. Let's see what happens. All right, let's get it, dude. Back to Kalos we go. A big stage, which can actually make it pretty good for the all mark So it just runs circles around the opponent. But at the same time, Fox is so fast at closing at a distance. Again, the dash attack, right? It's the party starter. Okay. Just seeing it right there. He's just all up in this opponent's face. But here it is. Okay, I thought we were going to see him dash forward and up smash. I see that a lot from the buzz. Gets him a lot of good damage. Just dash, uh, you know, up smash the double up air into like Pikmin throw. One of the things that I noticed that Shoot Town's taking advantage of is that Light likes to throw attacks on Shoot Town's shield and then try to throw another attack. So Shoot Town will block both attacks and then punish with up smash or something like that. For example, it's all right there. Yeah. He blocks it and does a very strong punish. Great usage of the whistle, but Light making sure to bring himself back to the ground in the nick of time to have the up smash at the ready. Here it is. He still has three. Let him pick me. He, he does not care. All right, 114. Let's watch out for that move pick. for that grab. And that was the point we're looking for. And I like him going for that back throw. It put the opponent on the platform to set up for some more sharking again. Here we have it. Okay, he has a pick on him, but he's going to keep applying the pressure. Understands. Air safe approach option. He has grab or jab as a mix up. Or even he could land Nair into like immediate short hop buffered Nair. Like fade back. That's how fast Fox is. You rarely see that mix up from people though. Alright, this is looking a lot better for Light. Looking for that back air. Nice. Hey. Does he get the drag down all the way? He commits. Okay, pulling back. Okay, I don't blame him going for that. Might as well. If he had gotten that up smash a bit, if she's trying to approach too hard, he would have been an entire two stocks ahead of like these double jump mix-ups here, and he's looking for a whip from Shutan. Okay, Nair and Shutan's such a scary opponent, though, man. You're going to have to work harder than that. I see him going for the down air, so he's mixing it up, understanding that he's been doing a lot of single hit pressure. You go for a down air, people will drop shield early after they block one move, and then they'll get hit, get hit by the rest of it there, leading to a potential up smash. They're not looking good right now. 86%, a lot of rage on, Olim on Olimar, and also White Pikmin was just on Fox. That was like 20 to 30% put on it. Yeah, he brought it back. But no Pikmin. Oh, okay, one purple. Is he doing the one purple again? Okay. Oh, my God. No Pikmin on the field here. The purple gone. Wait, actually back at it again. Is that back here? Oh, my. <laughs> he missed the first one, went for it a second time, got it to the next. Right now, light at the end of the road, potentially. Potentially, yes, sir. Okay, he gets the... Wow, neutral and crossed up his opponent with the grab. Okay, there it is. Safe on shield. Smart stuff, dude. Okay, getting a lot of good damage. Here's the chase. Okay, that dash attack, again, like I told you before, man, that's what... That's what usually is the catalyst to a lot of good damage for Fox. You don't want to get hit by that. Okay, Light, though, he understands that Shutan could rack up a lot of quick damage. And like for time, man, the one-up smash. Can't be too errant. There, there it, it is! What did I tell you? Yep. He dropped shield. Wow. Really good DI what a from Shutan. Yeah. He almost lived that. Dude, he did a really good mix-up right there on the shield, man. A lot of times, people have to remember, late game Fox, end game Fox, when you're at higher percent. And that's when you'll deal with the 50-50 of one hit on shield or multiple hits on shield. Oh, down air you, versus you, Yes, you rarely see that. I remember I, kept, I, remember I asked Larry Larry, like, why do you use more down air when it's like later percent after using so much net? neutral air? Well, you condition the opponent to expect neutral air, neutral air, neutral air, to the point where when it's at later percent and they're expecting it, they're going to try to block it and then release shield, and that's when you get them. So good job right there. Light again. Using the uh, amazing mix-up that opens up Free up smash conversions as you saw right there. And now, guys, hopefully your faith is restored in light if you are representing NA because this is the last North American representative here in the bracket. We have three players left here.
two from Japan, one from North America representing New England in life. Here we go, game number four. Let's see if the buzzes not dream or wish it can come true by saying that he thinks Shutong will take it free. He went from having, Light went from having six stocks on hand to taken away from him to be able to win that last game, taking three stocks to two. But right now, 90%. The edge guard and Shutong again. Fantastic, especially with that down tilt. Decided not to go off stage and try to stop that upbeat. Very, very difficult to deal with right here. Light getting swatted off stage with that purple. Had a double jump, and I like the use of the air dodge. We've seen that before. From the likes of Zach Ray, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Yep. Whistle, allowing him to continue to work. All right, but landing, what's he doing? Okay, I like that. Sign the air dodge into the stage. Yeah, it's never too bad to bust it out once in a while, right? Yeah. Just don't use it too much. I just, wow, okay, there it is. So he, he noticed right there that Shutan was being a little bit too pensive, yeah. waiting to see what he was going to do. So he's like, in that case, I'm going to grab you immediately. Okay, he's playing it really patient on the ledge before he just go for X smashes and try to get the KO. And oh, he didn't oh. even go at an angle. Almost thought he would go at an angle to try to mix it up. Because Shutan, again, really almost 100% accurate at getting these dares to work against like. Wow, and Katar, to be honest, I was surprised to see the range. Oh. That up smash hitting the, the roll behind. Yeah. But right there, 48. Three hits into 48%. Mm -hmm. And now we wait. Very he short character. Yeah, yeah, he wants to, but the character's so short, right? Yeah. You've got to be way more accurate and hit him later. Yeah, character's so short, it's going to be really hard to keep going for these backers. The shoot on. Still doing a fantastic job. Oh. And the white oh, just is. keeps tacking up damage. Wow, it did almost 40%. Wow. A girl with Blue Pikmin, yes, it's going to be a stock. And now it's game, set, stock right now for light. Honestly, Katara, we are potentially at the end of the oh, road he here. Put the white on him already. Yeah. And the percents. Okay. The white's gone, but yellow clipped him right there. We're not seeing him go for any drag down forward airs. Instead, he's staying on stage. Uh oh, the drag down forward air? Oh. Good try. Also has a lot of good frame data. And there's a white Pikmin on him again. He keeps getting caught by that white Pikmin. He's not shielding it. He's okay. giving so much damage. And it's making it harder for him to mount a comeback, too. Okay. All right. Back here. Good. I like him going back to the stage like that. But he has to watch out. There's a white. Okay, the white miss. Uh oh. No, he cannot keep blue Pikmin up there. Oh. He's okay. brave. I do like he, that. He wanted that, out to too. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. He and gets it every single time. Nice one. Right Ready to wall. Okay. Guys, 114%. You literally have to give him all of your energy if you want to see him purple stay alive here. here. We, back but here. we have a purple, <laughs> and it's, it might be gone. <laughs> he might go for it again. Yeah, he's keeping it. Okay, right. wait. Uh oh. Oh, uh -oh. my. Misses the tech chase. Goes inward. Yeah. The blues. The blue. Oh, yeah, the blue Pikmin, you're right. You can actually do a blue Pikmin up throw. Yeah. And he can do purple Pikmin back here. Light has to play absolutely immaculate. Here, it's a situation it. against the read. Beautiful. Wow. Shoots on actually going for that second double jump. Reed getting that up there with the yellow Pikmin. And it looks like we're actually going to have a Japan versus Japan.